Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swish, and I'm here reviewing Urban. This was a bearish gap down today that failed, lifted. Very often, traders love to buy these down gaps for gap fills. I know exactly what this did today. And it set up and didn't work as a short. If you did it, you took a loss, but it looks so good to follow through tomorrow as a short because it really is a short. But if you try to short this today, you could have made a little bit of money as a scalp, but it didn't have a big move down. It flipped. Here's where it bounced, right in here. This will break this area. It will follow through, flip, trade down, and break all the way down in here. So I may be watching this for a swing trade or to call as an option trade. We'll have to see how it looks tomorrow morning, where it gaps in the morning. But this is one of these ones that day traders love to buy them into support and then have them rally due to gap fills. That's not the correct way to look at this. If you'd done that today, you would have made money, but it wasn't the right thing to do. Ultimately, you have to find a system that has a level of consistency and a high level of probability, in which case this type of look here doesn't. And you see it's not going to fill the gap or do anything, but I know traders love to buy these into support. It is not getting institutional buying though today. How do I know? It's not going to follow through. It's not going to follow through higher. It's going to follow through lower. Okay. So it just so happened that the stock gapped down and made the move in the gap and didn't get any more selling in the live day. Closed last night at 2541. Open this morning, $2 down or thereabouts at 23.39. So the selling came into the gap and it didn't have any more selling to give today into the live day. And then traders lifted it on through. But it absolutely will follow through lower uh, tomorrow and we'll see where it goes. And this is not something I ever buy because the power, the source, the movement is to the downside here, not to the upside. I know it's green on the day and you only could have made money scalping this today for like a 40 cent move but it ultimately really is definitely lower. And so it did not work as a gap down today as a short. Uh, there were a bunch of other things that didn't, but this was one of the watches today. So I wanted to review it and why it didn't work. You can look for this for follow through tomorrow. Have a great day, everyone. If you're interested in learning more about gaps and which ways to trade them and play them, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a great day, everyone.